Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. The latest stable version of the Mozilla Firefox web browser, version 91, is now rolling out. It started rolling out today on the 10th of August 2021. This means now that we have also gone from version 90 to 91 in this latest stable release. Now in version 91 of Firefox, there are two major changes and the first is that there are now improvements to the total cookie protection feature and it also now um, offers support for logging into Microsoft work and school accounts. And over and above those two major changes, according to the release notes, there are also 1,200 bug fixes and I've also counted 12 important security fixes over on the release notes. Now, Basically, what Total Cookie Protection is, is it keeps your cookies to the sites where they were created in an attempt to prevent tracking cookies from third-party companies. And it's those tracking cookies that are used to send you, you know, marketing and spam and all the stuff that you don't really need. So it's good to know that there have been improvements to the Total Cookie Protection feature. And those improvements, according to Mozilla, are described as a more comprehensive logic to the cookie cleaning process which they say is designed to prevent hidden data leaks while making it easier for you to understand which websites are storing your local information. And then that second major feature, as mentioned, is now it's possible for Windows users to set up single sign-on for Microsoft accounts. And this basically makes it easier to access all your Microsoft school and work accounts from the Firefox web browser. And to get to that setting, we just head to our menu settings privacy and security and we just scroll down here and here's the setting allow windows single sign-on for microsoft work and school accounts you can click on the learn more link to find out more and it's actually off and um, disabled by default and i've enabled the uh, feature just to monitor what goes on with this new add-on so that will just help you uh, to have a single sign-on for your microsoft accounts now in the private browsing window new private window https is now enabled by default so this is an automatic process and you don't have to change any options or settings https is now enabled by default which means it will basically favor a secure https connection whenever this option is possible and viable and this is all automatic as mentioned you don't have to do anything to enable https by default and sticking in the a private browsing window uh, the address bar now um, provides switch to tab results in the uh, new private uh, browsing window as well so that is good to know and then another uh, feature that has been added a smaller mention is that a new scots locale has also been added in version 91 and according to mozilla there's also an increased responsiveness of about 10 to 20 percent to most user interactions and they say that this is thanks to a new catch-up paint feature. And then simplified printing is uh, returning in version 91. This was discontinued a while back, but now in version 91 of Firefox, um, it seems to be making a return. And if we just go back to our menu and we click on print, and then if we just head down here, you will see a setting here called more settings. And then where you should see the feature is between margins and options and you will have uh, two options original and simplified now i don't see the feature in my version 91 of mozilla now i don't know if this is on a controlled rollout or not it's not really mentioned in the release notes but in the release notes it says that this is a new feature but i don't actually see it in my version yet so maybe this is still on a controlled rollout and basically what simplified printing does it allows you to remove all those unnecessary elements from pages um, to obviously help you reduce your ink and paper wastage. And as I say, you can get to this by going to print um, more settings and then you just will find it around about here in those print settings. And if you would like to know if you have the latest version, as always, we just head up to our menu again and we go to help about Firefox and as of last uh, month's uh, Firefox update version 90, this will be an automatic process in the background, but the latest version you should be on is version 91.0. And then as always, we just click on what's new. And this takes us to see what's new in Firefox version 91. 
And yeah, we can see um, we'd like to extend a special thank you to the 210 volunteers who helped resolve more than 1,200 bugs in Firefox version 91 release. And then, yeah, are all of the changes, and I've mentioned most of these. And you can just go, you know, click on what's new and come have a more in-depth look at this if you are using Firefox. And then at the bottom, we have all of those um, important various security fixes, which there are 12 uh, important security fixes and a lot of those are rated as high so even if you are not interested in new features per se it's always important to make sure you're up to date and um, for those uh, important security vulnerabilities that have now been fixed in version 91. So version 91 started rolling out today on the 10th of August and that is the latest stable release of the Firefox web browser. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.